Yo, what's up guys, welcome back to the final episode of the top 50 player rating predictions for FIFA 20. The first player up is actually De Gea, who's actually not in the top 10. I have to make a disclaimer, I did miss him out, so I'm sorry De Gea. I'm trying my best. Yeah, so yeah, I gave him uh, De Gea a minus one downgrade. Um, I completely forgot about him when recording the previous episode, so yeah. Uh, he didn't have an amazing season, of course, but um, he, he had a good debut. Well, not debut, but return, didn't he? Uh, in 10th position, we've got Modric. He was a bound door winner, of course, last year, but um, I'm giving him a minus one downgrade. He did not have a very good season at all for Real Madrid, and that was, you know, uh, reflected in the team's performance. Ninth position, I've gone for an upgrade to Sergio Aguero. Um, yeah, he had uh, a very good season. He got 17 or 18 goals. Actually, no, he got more than that, didn't he? He got like 22, actually. I should reset. Yeah, sorry, recheck my stats really, but yeah, he had a had a good season nonetheless, and I think he's the best finisher in the world in my opinion. And um, in the eighth in eighth position, I've gone for Griezmann. He's getting a plus one. He's had a big money move to Barcelona, of course. He's going to be their main striker probably, and um, maybe alongside Suarez. We have to see what formation to go with, but um, amazing signing for Barcelona at a decent price as well, I think. And I think he'll do very well in that uh, Barcelona team, of course. In seventh position, I've actually gone for his teammate, of course, strike partner in Luis Suarez. Now, a lot of people actually want Suarez to get downgraded just because of his age and that, but I don't think he deserves a downgrade. He's still on the top of his game, in my opinion. Uh, and yeah, he deserves to keep that 9 1 raid. Uh, in sixth position, we've gone for Lewandowski, another player getting an upgrade. Had a very good season. He's proven himself as one of the best players in the world, consistently scoring 30 plus goals a season. Um, Played for one of the best clubs in the world in Bayern Munich. And uh, yeah, he deserves his plus one upgrade and a few uh, start upgrades as well. Fifth position I've gone for Virgil van Dijk, who many people are tip tipping to win the Ballon d'Or this year. He's had an amazing season. He's won so many awards, Player of the Year, you name it. I don't really speak too much about like to justify where he's going to be against this reign. Um, he could have been the covers of FIFA for uh, the Champions Edition, which I think I'll probably be getting. So yeah. In fourth position I've gone for Neymar. I'm going to keep him at 92, you could probably justify him to get a, a minus one, but I can't see that happening, PSG having the contract with EA and stuff now, um, also I think I have a position change to central, uh, that would be quite good for hybrids and that. In third position I've gone for Eden Hazard, who is controversially, I've given him an upgrade, now personally I'll keep him at 91, but if you look into like EA's head they'll be upgrading him, he's on the cover of, of like the standard edition that millions of people would be buying. Hazard is literally in a contract with them, there's no way they're not upgrading him in my opinion, so 92, very good player nonetheless, and he, yeah, 92 for Hazard. But in a uh, first position we've gone for. I'm Chris Smallem. And I'm Phil Jones. And this Lace. is Roommates. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I was just joking about that one of course, don't get triggered in the comments guys. Phil Jones and Chris Smallem are not the best player in the world. Oh, I actually missed one out, so number two, we've gone for Cristiano Ronaldo, playing for Pine Monto Kelsey. <laughs> oh my days. Why the hell he couldn't be bothered to pay the contract, I do not know. I guess Pez just overpaid. But yeah. But in first position is of course Mr. Clutch himself. Marcus Rojo! Oh. Okay, okay, I was just joking guys, I was just joking. Origi he's not 99 rated, he's 100 rated. So he's, he, he can't even be on this list. <laughs> okay. Messi's number one. The GOAT. Ronaldo fans are now getting triggered in the comments, shouting curse words at me, but whatever. I don't care. Don't at me, guys. So yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Let me know what you thought about like the sort of kind of more jokey stuff in this video. It might have failed, I don't know. Let me know what you think anyway. Till next time, goodbye.